Hello, we're going to make tutorial number 55 for YouTube. We have been installing Linux Mint 18 and we have uh, installed kernels, themes, icons and so on. And now we are at the very latest. We are checking if our icons here are all in the same color. And when you download the Sardi icon set, it is normally a grayish kind of uh, look. And let's quick have a look so you can compare. We have installed Mint White Dark here, Mint White Dark there, and also chosen for the desktop theme, which is this panel here, and particularly this, 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 and this, all uh, governed or uh, steered or, or changed with this one. So it has, well, you can make an icon, but um, the color will be uh, steered here, will be fixed in the Mint White Dark. So changing this already, maybe a good uh, time to see it. Voila. Same icons, color is different. So that's another movie. But what we're going to do now is uh, setting it to these settings. So you can see what happens. And then we're going to run a script which is uh, in, uh, delivered with the icons, which is this one, change gray icons to white icons how did I make the script let's analyze it it's going to well this is explanation it's going to change the color which is gray AAA six A's into white color from gray to white and it's going to look to several files and the files there is a text an input dot text file which is here it's set here. We have to run the script and then put input text behind it. And if you don't want to add particular icons to change, if you don't want them to change, you just delete the line or you want more icons to change, you add lines. And then what happens? It goes to every line and it says, okay, I'm going to change. If I find a fill with a particular color, this is the color, I'm going to change it to white. And then it's going to go through all that because there are different kind of ways how to define a color in the SVG files. So I have to add all these lines and also a stroke line, not just a fill, a filler, but a stroke as well. And then it says, okay, done. All right, let's take a look now at the input file, which is this one. So I went over all the most important the only 40 icons of out of 40,000 or so I don't know 3,000 icons and that's an interesting fact how many icons are there in Sardi of, out of 6,700 icons it's only 30 40 the ones here at the bottom we're going to change and what we're going to do is running it as simple as that so it's going to is called change change what you can do either do one thing going from gray to white and if you say no that's not it you can go back uh, to the gray icons so change icons back to original is going back from white to gray but first let's have a look let's go from gray to white icons we run this but I'm going to make a mistake I'm going to enter and it says nothing nothing happens it says, of course, that everything is done, but no, there is no input. Eh? There is no input. Line 80. So the input input.txt is not added. Nothing happens, but you should write this behind it. Now he has some input, and he's going to go through every line. Every icon is going to be looked at, changed, and uh, saved. Okay. Result being, I also wrote it in the script, which is still open here, which is still open here, here. Some of the icons will change immediately. Some of the icons you have to reboot. And other icons uh, are determined by the desktop, but I show you, I've shown you that. So these icons are not defined with uh, the icon set, with, with the team, the desktop team. So, um, I'm going to test something, I can't log off and film, so I'm going to restart Cinnamon. 
and we can see already some of the icons change so this has become white this has become white this has become white this is the theme which will never come white if I don't change my theme this is an SVG you will find in the at this that there is a white Dropbox PNG so you should add uh, the white PNG to the Dropbox in your local drive I've made a movie about that go check it out variety hasn't restarted but it's restarting now and it's white mint update hasn't restarted update mint yes mint is up to date here's my white icon this is not up to date and I don't know if that will go white I don't think so no so this are, these are the icons you have to reboot for this is one and this is never going to change because the PNG so you should really do something remember that's on YouTube and these three you should really change your theme or change the code in your theme which is an entirely uh, other move here voilà. so I've chosen something else and now we have all whites this one this is after reboot and this is after changing to an other PNG hope you like my idea to fix um, the icons and to be all, all in white here okay have fun <laughs>